Brickhill is one of the longest lasting sandbox sites on the internet, lasting for over 6 years and longer than other Roblox clones like Brick Planet. Brickhill has managed to grow from only 0 players in 2016 all the way to 900,000 in 2022. In this video, I will be going over the complete history of Brickhill and what led it to where it is today. But where did it all start? Alex and Luke Dunn, also known as Space Builder and Brick Luke, had played games like Roblox, Blockland, and Minecraft. The twins were previously inspired to create a game called Left Behind, a zombie survival game that can be found on GameJolt and other websites. But in the summer of 2015, Brick Hill had only been a small concept, and it was still in development. Alex and Luke Dunn had big plans for this game. In early 2016, Space Builder and Brick Luke decided to finally release the earliest versions of Brick Hill. The avatars on the site could be seen as almost a close resemblance to LEGO. The site had not been made public yet, but on March 18th of 2016, Brick Hill was claimed to be officially founded. Later during the year on the 17th of November, the domain had been registered and the site was hosted. This is the oldest archive I could find from the Brick Hill website. It had three images revealing early testing of Brick Hill, and there also happens to be a download link on the top called BrickHill.zip, which was presumably the testing client for the game. It took all the way till the 18th and 20th of December for Brick Hill's member count to grow from around only two accounts to nine. The following year in 2017, close beta had began and users who signed up for beta gained access in November of 2016. Out of all 80 supposed signed ups, only 36 registered on the website. Other ways people could gain access to the site were donating at least $2 or through staff selecting certain users. On the 15th of April, closed beta ended and it wouldn't be long till the website would publicly release. The jackpot page had been introduced not long before and users who scored 4 AEO avatars would receive an award upon registering their account. 536 accounts had been registered on the first day of public release and the first egg hunt began on the 16th of April, only one day after the website had been opened. Players would refresh their pages several times in order to obtain the bunny egg and there were only 6 other eggs, with one called the binary egg, which almost looks identical to Roblox's Charles Babbage Fabergé egg. Here are the 4 other eggs you were able to collect. But on the 23rd of April, this egg hunt was delayed to May, as the website was supposedly hacked or rolled back. Brick Hill had a dry spell of inactivity till October 7th of 2017, where activity would boost on the website as the first Brick Hill client was released. On the 17th of December, the winter building contest begins, and Brick Hill reaches 10,000 members for the first time on the 27th of December. But only 4 days later on December 31st, founder Alex Dunn would announce that Luke Dunn had died of natural causes. The iconic fedora on Brick Hill was later renamed to Brick Luke's fedora to honor his legacy. On January 25th of 2018, the Brick Hill Awards were hosted, with the results coming out months later on October 4th. The second egg hunt was open on the 22nd of March, lasting all the way to June, which was way past the Easter holiday. On April Fools of 2018, the Big Buck Bonanza was introduced, claiming that Brick Hill had a big money making scheme where you'd have to click on numerous ads every 30 minutes in order to continue using the website. Those who clicked the most ads would earn prizes and exclusive items. On the 26th of August, something happened that would surge Brick Hill's player count. Another Roblox ripoff by the name Brick Planet had announced they would be shutting down. This caused tons of players from Brick Planet to migrate over to Brick Hill. The following year, on January 1st, the website and the logo had been rebranded. Brick Hill reached 50,000 users in February of 2019, and the 2019 egg hunt was released on the 22nd of March. These are the eggs you were able to receive from the 2019 Brick Hill egg hunt. Only 4 months after Brick Hill reached 50,000 users, it had doubled all the way to 100,000. This is most likely due to YouTubers making videos on Brick Hill in the same year, which had caused a newer player base to be introduced to the game. The Reach the Sky event was introduced on August 24th, where players would spawn a brick and build a tower until it's at the height of a thousand bricks. 
players who got their towers to reach a thousand bricks earned the Halo accessory. There were also present drops on the 7th of December where players would be able to earn these accessories from gifts that opened in their inventory. The next year in 2020, not much had happened on Brick Hill. A lot of the players from 2019 had gone inactive or stopped playing. The fourth trick or treat event occurred and the third present drop had also occurred. As of today in 2022, Brick Hill still has a somewhat active community and Discord server. However, Brick Hill had lost a lot of its player base and although the site has around 950,000 accounts signed up, there is barely anyone else playing. These types of Roblox sandbox clones usually don't last for long and it's surprising Brick Hill has lasted for over 6 years and still hasn't shut down at least once.